We're starting with Chicago's mayoral election just three days away. We have new early voting totals tonight, too. More than 193,000 ballots cast so far. About half have been cast in person, and the other half were returned by mail. Candidates in this 11th hour are making last-minute appeals to voters. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman tells us it's still anybody's race. Polls show at this late stage in the game, 19% of voters are still undecided, which means these final days of campaigning can make all of the difference for these candidates. If you don't vote for your candidate that you want, they're not going to make the runoff. In the final days of a whirlwind mayoral race, it all comes down to voter turnout. Neighbors showed up at Kenwood Academy in Hyde Park to hear some of the candidates on why they should take the city's top seat. No one knew who I was a couple of months ago, but they know who I am now. Brandon Johnson asking undecided voters to get to know him ahead of Tuesday. As our message continues to resonate as we knock doors, as we make phone calls, as our volunteers continue to hit the pavement, I'm very, very confident that the people of Chicago will know who is best prepared and positioned uh, to represent their interests. They need to be able to make real choices about their future. Roderick Sawyer talking education in hopes of reaching younger voters with his push to boost Chicago public schools. This is what a 21st century education program should look like, focusing on the children, not focusing on buildings, not focused on loaded administration. Who will be the unifying steady hand that Chicago needs today? In the 47th Ward, Congressman Jesus Chewy Garcia asking voters to think about this as they head to the polls. Think about experience, about history, who has done the hard work. <laughs> And it was music and dancing at a Women for Lori grassroots event as incumbent mayor Lori Lightfoot called for her supporters to vote her in for another four years. Four more days for us to prove that we will not go backwards in our city. On the ballot is all the progress that we have made over these last four years. Early voter turnout has already surpassed numbers from 2015 and 2019, respectively. So far, 180,000 mail-in ballots have been cast as of Friday. Reporting in the control room, Marissa Perlman, CBS2 News. And you can watch live results come in on election night. Our coverage starts at 7 on our digital streaming network, CBS News Chicago. And you can find it on Pluto TV or our app, CBS Chicago.